All right, time to see what Samano's doing on the future side of things, eh? But yes, that guy is literally Jean Reno. Not only does it look like him, it's actually played by him. Although the voice actor for English is not him, which is weird. Okay, and on the future we get to fight the entire Eiffel Tower, right? The whole thing. Temple. If it all goes well, Dad will be back before you know it. Serious? Dad can come back? Serial? <laughs> what is it, Samanosuke? If Jacques doesn't succeed, Nobunaga could come to this world. The time folder must be stopped at all costs. Michelle, you stay here with Henri. Let's go, Akko. Okay, then. The question is, will Samano get a nice little endless situation where he'll get to max out all his shit as well? Also, of course, the first thing I find is another one of these goddamn things. Okay. Um, the fact that this one's already set up makes me think we need to move it, doesn't it? <laughs> Kinda. I know. The voice acting for Samano is very out of place. It doesn't even sound like that voice should be coming out of his mouth. It's super weird. Um, man, what do I want to do here? I'm hard. I'm in a hard time deciding. What if I go like that? Like that? Like that? Like that? Like that and then like, no. No. No, that was dumb. Don't make dumb choices like that ever again. Um, okay, how about... How how about... Um, well, I'd like to keep watching the stream. You actually plan to replay a good old game tonight. King's Quest V. What a what an old game, X-Gamer. Well, go have, have fun playing that, but thank you for stopping by to say hi. I appreciate it. Just don't be dumb, forehead. Yeah, Garzonis, I'm trying. I'm, real, I'm trying real hard. I'm trying real hard. Um, man, 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 damn. Uh, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'll reset that. Hold up. What if I move this one in some way? Question is, what would I move here in its place if I did move it? That doesn't make any sense, does it? No. There's nothing to move there in its place, like, with enough moves. So I think this one just has to stay here like it is. Because the nearest ones that can move there are here and here, and that takes a lot of moves to get there. Or this one, I guess, too. But either way, that would take a lot of moves to get that one there, I think. <sighs> the point is, I just gotta redirect something else. Um... Is there any reason to try and get this piece here at all? Not really, right? I'm trying to think if there's any other ones I want to like move from where they're at. got to be something that makes sense to me and then I can probably just get it. <sighs> something needs to make sense. Something needs to make sense. Um. Um. Huh. Man. Everything I immediately see doesn't make sense. So I'm like, what's the difference here? I mean, shit, we almost have the whole board cover if I do that. 
covered if I do that. No. Wait, what if I did that? Wait. Hold up. I did that. If I move that there, that there. That there. Uh... It's actually pretty close. have the shape that would need to go here I'd have to put that there basically this would have to go there and this would have to go here to make that strat work or wait 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 no I don't want to hint crystal no hints no hints um hold up That is pretty close though. If I could actually get one of these here, we'd be done. Hold up. Hold up. There. That doing it wrong the other way made me figure it out the right way. We got it. We got it. I think you're supposed to put the input with both the outputs. You right. That's what I did at Sprite Limit. Did you see there? I did it. <laughs> anyway, I got it, guys. Don't worry. We're in there. Sometimes that... Nothing has taken me as long as that one. There's one that took me like a million years. That one didn't take me nowhere near as long. There's a glowy red button. Push Of course push it. Why would I not push the glowy red button? Are you kidding me? Always push the glowy red button. Are you serious? Don't ask dumb questions, video game. Just do it. Push the red button. Nah, fuck the red button. Might be the only button in the whole room. Don't press it. Yeah, look how close I am to red armor leveling up. Very close. Alright. So we maxed out the armor and two weapons. I need enough for one whole weapon and the gauntlet. The gauntlet actually takes less than 10, I'm pretty sure. So probably around 18. And we can max out um, Samano. That'd be nice. Might as well save it while I'm at it since I already solved the puzzle. Hitting that 11 hour mark already. Ranmaru should be up there. Mm -hmm. Well, let's get up there and fudge him up, yo. More red buttons? Maybe? No? Oh. No? Oh, maybe you gotta hit the red button on this side. Duh. Bro, you solved that puzzle up its ass. Big time. That is the weirdest worded thing I've ever heard. <laughs> you pu you solved that puzzle up its ass. Yeah, yeah, I sure did. <laughs> Get crushed, bitch. Now give me all your souls. You got more for the elevator battle, bitch? Oh. Hit the red button. Oh. Emergency elevator. Activated. Now climb the rest of the Eiffel Tower without an elevator. Do it. Do it now. Ow. Hit. How dare you. Might as well, am I right? This is what we got magic for. 
Uh, is that a ladder? I guess that's a ladder as well. Can it take me higher? Up the Eiffel Tower and shit. Can it take me higher? Go get me that treasure, you bitch. I'll take it. Only med level one, baby. Dude, stop it, you bitch. Where's this magic guy who's unleashing this shit? Get out of here. Where's he at? Ah, uh, what? What? What did I do? Hello? Oh, did this start me back at the bottom? Totally did. Also, damn! The counter is real, baby. The counter is real. Even if it's on accident. Okay, so just don't get caught in those. Those just make you get sucked into another reset, basically. It's like a wall master. Don't let it suck you in, dog. I thought there was a magic guy around controlling those. I didn't realize they were just freaking wall master holes to start you over. Ah, <sighs> where'd this guy go? I just want to kill him. Oh, did he, did he die? Maybe he got, uh... Maybe he got wrecked. Give me that health. Kind of need it a little bit. Just being wary for these wall master holes. Dude, could y'all stop with the Sonic the Hedgehog bullshit for like a second? Oh god, no, 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 no. No. Just give me a fucking second here. God. This small ass area where I can't I have to like wait for your ass to stop doing that shit. Cut it out. Let me kill you. Alright, guy. You are you scared? Come at me, bro. <laughs> Suck it. I ain't dealing with your shit. Oh, hello. Oh, one of these guys. Okay. One of these wise guys, eh? Holy crap, that almost killed me. Oh, we are low on health. I did not realize we did not have any heal things with him. Remember when I had seven herbs a minute ago and then I lost them all in that one fight? That was pretty neat, though, right? Why aren't you blocking? I don't know. Happening. All I know is it hurts. All I know is the camera changed on me. <laughs> Fuck! I can't. I'm trying to get up. I can't. I can't. Please, mommy. Let me up. Now that move is so ridiculously strong. Lags the hell out of the screen. Finally got it. Please give me a lot of health. Yay! It's unfortunate I had to use a couple heals there. Oh yeah, I want a map of the Eiffel Tower right now. That's what I need. I'd much rather have some health video game. There better be a freaking moment where I can grind with 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 Samino. I'm gonna be sad if there's not. Wait, is that the way I have to go? Thought for sure we were gonna go in this door over here. Or in here rather. Oh, does that just never end? Oh. Okay. Okay, I thought this was one of the pools of stuff that stopped after every minute or something, you know? Oh maybe it will stop after I destroy this thing. I see it shattering, slowly but surely. Chinks in the armor, yo. Why you take so many hits when uh, you clearly 
are just needing to break, please. Boy, they just break. Thank you. And that that is the way we need to go. After I saw this, I made sense, so I get it. I guess they made it harder to break because just in case you wanted to do it after you fought. Actually, these might be the guys to grind on, if I really think about it. If I can get a good thing going, god damn it. Block that shit, bitch. I cannot do anything. It's too DPC, apparently. Give me health, all of it. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. It's like either that or maybe die, and I'm like, I don't wanna die. Are they all dead or. I really hate the camera angle sometimes. Again, I wouldn't mind going back to grind on those guys if there was a save point nearby. But I can assume probably safely that by the time we hit the top of this tower, there should be a save point again. That would be nice. See ya! That's dead end. God, I hate fighting these things. It's impossible to get them to come down to fight me, man. You hear they're remaking the Castlevania series? What does that mean? Remaking. Is that you mean like the cartoon? You mean like the actual video game series? What does that mean? How do you remake them? Wait, okay, when you say remake, do you mean like they're gonna go back to the originals and remaster them to be all cool looking? Like the same exact games just make them look nice? So like remastering. More so than remaking. No, no, no! Motherfucker. It's not that far back, but it's annoying. God damn it. I'd like to use a different weapon, but these big cat guys need this weapon. Give me your souls. Give them to me. Medicine? Secret medicine. That's actually really good. Okay, I'll take that. Faux show. Oh fuck, he didn't die. Give me health, give me health. No? Yeah, I'm not fucking give me like any health. Mother I I, I can hear him? Technically, I just didn't know what was coming at me. God damn it. I'm checking down here first. Or it's a dead end, never mind. No! Oh, how's that fair? It appeared as I was walking up. <sighs> the only good thing is that was literally right there. Anyway, if it's just a rumor for now, Crystal, don't worry about it. I. I can't imagine them remaking the originals other than just like taking the old games and just making it look real pretty in HD or whatever, you know? Because why would you remake a game that people are, like a, a series of games people love? They just ported them anyways as a collection. Like I, I don't think the originals need that much improvement other than some quality of life stuff more than anything. Because they're hard games, sure, but... The appeal of them is their challenge. To re-release them to make them look nice and then take away the challenge would be weird. 
so I don't know. I'm not saying they shouldn't do it, it'd just be weird. I would rather them just port all the freaking Metroidvania ones. That's what I would rather them do. Like, take all of them and put them in a collection. That's what I'm waiting for. I'm hoping they do a Metroidvania collection with all of them. All the GBA and DS ones. Or at least, you know, whichever, however many there are, I don't even know. It doesn't even have to include something tonight the because they already have a, you know, a little small collection of that with with Rondo of Blood, which I also need to play. By the way, I don't know if I, you, I've ever told you guys I haven't played Rondo of Blood. I've actually never played Rondo of Blood. So if I ever do get around to Symphony of the Night someday, I will definitely play Rondo of Blood first because I've never played it. I will take it, but first I'm gonna suck in some souls. He's a yay, Herb. Okay, are we to a save point yet? I mean, I don't have enough to level up, anyways. Come here, you doll. Where'd that doll go. Where'd it go? Got it. Where'd the dang thing go? Come here, you little bitch. Where are you going? How did I miss? What the hell? Yeah, right there. Where'd the fucking little doll bitch go, though? She's gonna be around here somewhere. They, I know they disappear, but they don't... I always get the item from them, even if they disappear. They like to fucking run around, though. Where'd that little bitch go? It's like the worst spot for one of those dolls. You can't see shit over here. Whatever. We definitely need a break from Oni. Soul Arrow. Okay. Cool. I don't think I have any of those. We definitely need a break from Oni, so maybe you'll buy me Lemon and Innocence instead. Instead, it'd be cool to see you experience Castlevania Origin Story with your boy Leon. I mean, it's your prerogative, uh, Ethereal. You can do whatever you want, dude. Time Lab 6. According to the research of the Lake Guildenstern, two separate pulses must be considered one operating the time folder. First is the pulse of time. Time itself has a pulse, and the time folder is active without being tuned to the pulse of time. <laughs> the pulse are active in the without saying the pulse. It results in the more attacks, no more psalmus, get catchy. Second is the pulse of Earth. The device is being installed at the location that the tune with the pulse of the Earth itself. Pulse waivers that can cause an unstable fold in time. We determine that the structure called the Eiffel Tower in the center of the city matches the device's need for the strong pulse of t both time and Earth. Okay. Soon we'll be able to welcome Lord Ganma. Ranmaru wrote some notes for us. Thanks, Ranmaru. I don't know what happened to that damn doll, but fuck that doll. Assassin's Creed Valhalla might be the first Assassin's Creed game you buy. Crystal? You never played any of them? I mean, I can understand, like, there's so many and just, like, you know, like if you had played a few and you just got sick of them like I did, but, like, you've never played any. That's weird. There's so many of them. How can you avoid them all unless you just really don't have to see the appeal? Because I, I, when I first saw the first one, I was like, holy shit, this looks fun as hell. And I played it, and I loved it. And the second one came out, and I loved it even more. And then I was like, well, this is a pretty cool series. I'll keep going. And then I played like the sequels to the second one, which were both okay. And then the third one came out, and was super hyped for it. And then I was so disappointed. I was just like, you know... I don't like this that much. And then I just said, no, I'm not playing Assassin's Creed anymore. And since then, they've made like six more, and I played none of them. But at least I was there, you know, I tried them, I played them along the way, and just got... It's because they started making them yearly. I think that's where, where the quality started dipping. They needed to focus more on making more improvements and stop trying to be all yearly like Call of Duty's bullshit. That was, that was like a downfall of gaming for a few years there. Everybody trying to have yearly everything. Like, bruh, you can't have a game yearly and make it be that good. 
You never played any of them either, Dragon? But see, I'm not surprised that you haven't played any of them. That doesn't surprise me. You saw your friend play one of them that was on 360 and it looked shit? Was it the first one? Because the first one does kind of look shit. But when it first came out, it looked awesome. Oh, hey, guy with sword. What's up, bro? Would you like an axe to the face? Ah! He's got reach on me. Alright, you, 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 sir. You're gonna eat some of my good shit. Here we go. Check it. Eat some of that good! Let's go. <laughs> Get chopped in half, boy. You do, however, like the story from Assassin's Creed. You know, the actual overall story? Like the stuff with the animus and going back into your ancestor and all that? Yes, that part I actually really like about Assassin's Creed. That's part of why I did not like the third one as much. Because I didn't like where it was going. And then the third one kind of ended it. So I was kind of like, if that's the ending for this arc, I'm kind of over it. But then again, I heard Assassin's Creed 4 was awesome. And I was very tempted to jump back into it. But I was just so over the third one that I was like, you know what? No, I'm not doing it. And here I am years later. Still haven't played the fourth one or anything since then. But trust me, I've been wanting to just, again, let's play. Streaming. It's just something I... I it feels weird to just play the fourth one and on from, for you guys. But, I mean, I'm sure nobody would really care. But it would still feel weird. Not that I want to play all the Assassin's Creed. That's too many Assassin's Creed's. But yeah. I might consider playing the fourth one one day for you guys, just because. Just because I'm curious and I'll probably want to play it at some point, so. Yeah. And if I enjoy myself enough, hey, try some newer ones. But at this point, I don't think it really matters if you play them in order, so. Just play whatever ones you want. I think the only ones you gotta play in order are 1, 2, and 3. Just because it all connects together with the whole main character. But I don't know how they connect after that. Also, I do not have enough to level up Tenso. Shit. Uh. Should I just do the Oni Gauntlet? I also don't know if this is going to max out if I do it. Well, let's just do it. I'm not going to be able to max out Tenso anyways, so... Wow. Why does this feel like this costs more than it did for freaking Jock? I feel like Jacques got there with 8 levels. Freaking, it's gonna cost 10 for... Maybe it did cost 10, I don't know. Either way, I didn't have enough to max out anything. Oh well. That's how you feel about zombie games. But like... I... I don't know what you mean. I... I know you guys are all over the place with this conversation all of a sudden. <laughs> Let's go confront Ranmaru, shall we? Ranmaru! Ranmaru! Still alive, Samanosuke? Whatever. Our Lord. I won't permit it. I need your permission. Glowy yellow sword arm. Oh no. We'll make the perfect welcoming gift for the Lord. As will yours, good sir. Ooh, get it. Okay. Uh. Okay, I'm trying to do some little slide dodges. It's not happening. Ooh, I'll take all of that shit. No! He still does that shit? Oh, that's annoying. Fuck. Okay. Do I really not have four purple orbs at this moment? That's stupid. I thought I would have had four purple orbs by now, you know? God damn it. Whatever. Get it! Oh, what? Oh, 
hit him. Block that shit, bitch. No! I want that purple orb, though. Yes! Have some of this shit. That was a very ineffective <laughs> pony mode for sure. Fuck. Yo, let's go. Got him. All I used was one herb, right? That was pretty good. No. <laughs> Our Lord. Our Lord is near. Welcome. Chop away, sir. It's not going to work. You must stop Nobunaga from coming here at all costs. Yes. All right, back to Jacques, where he's got to stop Nobunaga coming here at all costs. We're gonna have to. We gotta use Samino one more time, right? We can't. That just can't be the end of Samino in this game. Right. He could have at least tried to flip the switch. I agree. Let's chop it with my sword three times and say all is lost. He didn't even try the switch. Am I right? Dum dum. Necessary if you are. Unless, unless Samino actually gets to go through it. Like, Jock has already had enough, man. He's already maxed out, bro. Apparently, it doesn't matter. Let's let Jock have all the fucking maxing out. Samino doesn't get any of that. I hope Samino still has one more part where he can do that. It would be nice. I don't even know why I'm bothering with this shit. I'm already full health. I don't need any of these orbs. Unless somehow I can share them with Samino. What's the point? Or if these guys are actually going to drop health. That would be the only other reason to fight them. When I say drop health, I mean like healing items. Which again, Jacques doesn't even need that many. It's freaking Samino who's low on shit. Low on shit and he hasn't maxed out his shit. I feel like this game is trying to favor Reno. I mean, in general, it's been pretty even overall, I would say. But this last couple parts, for sure, has been more John Reno, for sure. Like, the ice part and this part has definitely favored John. Mr. Jacques Jean Reno. This is as far as you hey, look, go. Ranmaru in a different era. He's back. Leave this to me. This one's for Heihachi. This is for Heihachi, my friend for five minutes. Ooh, get him. Nice. Fuck actually playing this fight, because we just beat him two seconds ago. Why make me do it again, am I right? Got him. Damn. Punched him out of his goddamn shoes. Well then. <laughs> You've been avenged, Heiachi. 
Let's go. Nobunaga is here. God forbid they make me fight the same guy two times in a row with two different characters. Not like that would have been clever or anything. Anyway, we got a Ranmaru scroll for defeating Ranmaru. What, what, what does that have to do with anything? I don't know. I received communication from Guildenstern. I can hardly really believe what that secret that seems to be lie in the future. Knowing him, he's taken an interest in it. But what is this future? He comes with the pulse of the times, each different each day, and each spot. Again, we get Guildenstern. He never makes sense. Now he's ordered us to go to Hanoji Temple in Kyoto as a, at the precise time on a certain day. Does he not know his own rank? How dare a mere vassal call upon our lord? Whatever the case, I'm prepared to protect our lord with our life. my life. Well, not if Jacques Renault had anything to say about it. Okay, that's fine. I don't know if I need that or not, but okay. What makes you sad is they killed off Sam Samo's sexy ninja sidekick from the first game, Kaede. Did they kill her or they just don't have her anymore? I don't remember her dying. Did she die? I can't remember now. It's been a while since I played the first game. Oh fuck, what the hell is this guy doing here? You gotta be shitting me. I'm not doing these anymore. No. No, I refuse. I refuse to play your game. I'm not playing. I refuse. I'm not spending two hours doing that shit again. Nope. I refuse. They said she died in a... In a wait. They said she died in what was a stop motion cutscene. Like, in the original they did that, or they did that in the second game? Alright. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. Let's go kick Dabu Nugga's ass. Say it again. Are you... Oh. In the original, before the credits? So they did it, like, right at the end. They said she died? Okay. I honestly don't even remember the ending, other than, like, we had to fight. I remember the boss we fought at the end of the first one, but that's, like, all I remember. Dude, we're all gonna burn if you let make me stand in the fire, Samano. Goddamn, for following me into the fire corners. Why they put a challenge thing right before the end, I'll never know. Uh, granted, that is this the ending? I, I don't know. We're gonna find out. Me and you, Nobunaga, let's do this. So you've come. First it was Jupiter Yagi, and now... Samanosuke Akechi. See that the only children have come to stop me once again, have they? Very well. Nobunaga! This is where it all ends. You cannot prevent my conquest. Die. Aoroni! <laughs> 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 Zemanosuke! You're up next, Western Barbarian. Damn you. Who are you calling a Barbarian? How dare you indeed. Get it! Okay. It's cool. Yeah. See you! See you! See you! Ah! Uh, see you! Just gonna keep using that shit. Shook him. 
come on. There you go. Suck it. Okay. He grabbed me. He's doing a thing, and it hurts. Please stop. It hurts. Please stop. It hurts. Please stop. It hurts. Woo, shook him. Okay, ow, that hurt. Okay, that hurt too. Maybe a little heals is in, in order now. Dude, I got, I got like herb for days, dog. I got so many heals on this boy. He got eight medicines. That's ridiculous. All right, through this. Got the finisher on me though. Fuck it. <laughs> it's just so slow. No qualms about using up all my magic on this guy. Like, what am I, what am I saving it for? Not this guy. I mean, if he has another form, like every other freaking game, that's fine. Like the other two games, but that's fine and everything. But I might as well use up my magic, you know. I'm even tempted to go Oni mode on him. Just wondering if I should bother, or if I should be saving it, you know. I basically used up all my magic now. Ah, shit. Yeah. All right, I'll use a medicine then. Um, screw it. I don't know what I'm gonna need. Fuck it. Fuck his shit up. Oh wow! As soon as I use it, he's like two hits away. God damn it. Well, let's see what happens. <laughs> Cause I know it ain't over yet. There's either form two or now Samino has to fight him. Something's gonna happen. Is that really it for Jacques already? Or he's gonna have to fight in present day also? Goodbye, Jacques. I owe you one. Yeah. It was a blast. Yeah, see, no what not gonna be dead, yo. It ain't over, yo.
Well, I guess the old Samano gets to die, but the new one, the other one, can come back and replace himself, right? <laughs> well, now we get to teleport back to the same spot and fight Nobunaga there with Samano instead. I could, you know, I believe I, that's gonna happen because that's where the freaking last challenge thing is at, that I didn't do. Now Samano's gonna go there, and not, I'm not gonna do it with him either. But it will at least give me a moment to grind for the rest of the freaking levels for Samano. God, I want, I'm not even maxed out with him, man. I wanna be. I wanna be. Henri. Daddy! Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Shock. You shall. told me everything. I'll go back to my time and defeat Nobunaga. Not without me. No. We'll fight Nobunaga together. That won't work. The folds of time are trying to restore us to our respective times. I'm happy for you, Henri. Samanosuke. Treat your new mother well. The three of you will make a good family. Yeah. Thank you. I'll never forget you. Samanosuke. Kick his ass. Farewell. You Just watch your friends. French, young man. <laughs> he said the A word. Ooh. You know the one that means but? <gasps> I said but. Goodbye. Goodbye. We need one last moment with them before Samano goes to do his thing? Come on now. Oh shit. Oh shit. What? No. What the actual fuck is happening right now? He just chopped a little kid, dude. That is not okay. They're speaking French again, by the way. Wow. Wow. Wow! This got fucked real fast. What the actual hell? No. Oh wait, he's got the thing. Hold on, he's got the power. I was gonna say that's fucking insane to just like at the last second just kill the little kid off. Ridiculous. <laughs> I was gonna say. Merci. Merci infiniment. 
Force du démon. Merci. Merci. I was wondering why they lingered on this for so long. I was like, we got shit to take care of with Samano. Who cares about their happily ever after? We ain't done yet. But now I get it. But still, they could have still done that, like, after Samano did his thing. But I guess they don't want to have a reason to come back here. I don't know. We almost had a Barrett moment? No, we will never have a Barrett moment, bro. Never, ever. And everything in France went back to normal. <laughs> All right, now, now it's time to finish this game for reals. Exactly where I thought we would teleport. All right, here we go, baby. All right, it's time for some Samino ass whoopings. And Maru lies dead in his unmutated state. I feel pity for him. I don't. So which Samino is the one that died? So the one, the Samino that died was like the one in the past that didn't teleport. Like from before Samino actually teleported. It's fucking weird. It doesn't make any fucking sense. But you know what? It's fine. <laughs> All right, we have full health. We're good. I don't. Ha I, I, there's nothing I can do about being maxed out though. This is kind of lame. At least I have six heals, or five heals, rather, and I have two Oni meds. Oh, these don't heal what I thought. Okay, they heal magic. Okay. I gotta remember to use those. Basically, yeah. Samano that died was the one from the first game. That's the best way to look at it. Yes, that was that one. Anyway. We're making a save, y'all. Put it this way, I have way more heals than I ever did when I beat the last game. So, Oni 2. Oni 2, I ended up at the end with no heals. So, yeah, exactly. I was just saying that ethereal. <laughs> I'm in a much better position than I was in that game. That's for damn sure. Let's see how this goes. Is it going to be the same shit just with Samino, or is it going to have, like, another form? So, Barbarian has run away. Yeah, you thought you killed me, but boo, here I am. Form two, baby. Me again. <laughs> me again? <laughs> oh shit. Soul power, baby. Oh fuck, we just going straight Oni mode? Oh hell yeah. Is this just gonna be an ass whipping? Like, we're not even have to have a challenge here? <laughs> fuck you, buddy! You can't handle the Oni, bitch! I'm just going ape. I'm just going ape. Get, take it in the ass, Nobunaga. Wow, that can't be all. There's got to be another form here. Hold on. <laughs> I felt good for a second. It didn't last nearly long enough. Okay, see, now, now, now it looks like the end. Here we go. <laughs> you want a final battlefield, here you go. I'm still Oni mode, though, so that's nice. Alright, let the true final battle begin. What's funny, bitch? Let's do this. Key up! Oh, well... Trying. These things are in my way, though. Lots of orbs. Ah, uh, can I please? Uh. Oh 
Okay. This is not going well. Okay. We gotta be a little careful here. So we're stuck with the weapon we're using. We're using the Oni Musha sword. Okay. Anyway, this is uh, going well. Um. Oh, okay. I actually have a chop move here. This is fun. I could just spam this? You gotta be shitting me. Here we go. Oni mode, bitch. What? My. Oh my. What? What? Well, I have the revival thing, so there you go. I guess I'm hitting him now. I mean, I can just spam this fucking move. It helps me dodge a little bit more. It does damage. I literally just spam this shit. I don't even know if I'm actually killing... Oh, I got... I actually hit him in the face. I feel like I got stunned for a second. Ah, hold on. I only have. I, I do have one more revival thing. But let's not have to use that. Let's just use a first aid kit. Ah, shit. Okay, I see. You just have to you just have to absorb enough orbs to get your sword all charged up. And then you kick ass, I guess. Alright, hold up. I'm getting wrecked again, hold up. Oh get fucked! Get fucked, Nobunaga. Oh, so much damage. Get up. Oh, get some. I'm like, this battle's gonna take a while if it's. If it, oh, nice. Dude, if you time shit right, it's over, dude. Wow, I am... Am I supposed to do something with his sword, maybe? I mean, I don't seem to be able to grab the sword or anything. Am I supposed to, like, suck in... Oh! Oh, I am! I am. I just realized I could suck in the soul from his sword. Okay, I get it. That makes sense. There we go. There we go. There we go. Now something's happening. Oh, his sword is my sword now, bitch! My sword now, bitch! I tried to block it. I actually didn't do as much damage as I thought it might. Okay, well, can't block all the fireballs. Just learn that the hard way. Alright, alright, alright. Careful now. You only got so many... You only got one more revival thing. Use up your heals while you have them. Man, this is a, a lot of hits, shall we say. I'm just, you know, I'm just going with the with the tried and true strat of spam, just because until it doesn't work, you, you, you do it until it doesn't work, right? Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Is that all, folks? Give or take a few. What a wink in the life of the cosmos. A dream. Or an 
delusion. <laughs> Take his soul. Very well. Very well. Oh boy, we finally beat him, Semenosuke. to you, Jacques, and to the Oni clan. <gasps> Semenosuke, we've got a scram! Cue Metroid escape sequence. Go! No, no. June 2nd, 1582, Honoji Temple. Nobunaga is lost in the raging inferno. However, a hidden history still remains. This concludes another chapter in the epic Oni Genma War. Are they teasing me for another Oni game at the end of an Oni game? I mean, I don't know when else you're supposed to do that. Oh, nice green, luscious fields, trees, blue skies, pixelated ass flowers. What more could I ask for? Samano and the fairy got married and lived happily ever after. And thus ended the long conflict between Samanusuke Akechi and Nobunaga Oda. But a new journey has already begun and will not end until the gauntlet which had silenced Nobunaga is sealed. Okay then. Does that mean we have a... We got a plot for the next game already. And that's Onimusha 3 Demon Siege, everybody. Did you like it? Inafune was the fucking producer on that? I guess K Capcom makes sense. Anyway, alright. Well, guys, again, that's Onimusha. Um, Onimusha 3. Interesting video game. Very weird. The series definitely went off the rails. Decent game. Fun enough to play. Definitely way less frustrating than Onimusha 2. Oh my god. Onimusha 2, besides the final boss being ridiculously hard comparatively, um, you know, I think Onimusha 2 was way harder um, as a game in general. This game was way easier. Way easier. Like, oh my god, way easier. Especially if you didn't spam and use up all your healing items, which I used plenty that I probably didn't need to use in this playthrough, but I still ended up with way more more than enough for this game. And, uh, well, that last battle against Nobunaga is just... is just, uh, I, it's a cakewalk. It really is. Like, I wasn't even trying. I was literally just fucking spamming my damn triangle attack the whole time, and it worked really well, actually. I don't know if there's any more finesse to it than that. Um, yeah. I don't know what else to say about it. Definitely a way easier game. Still fun. A little weird. Uh, story's definitely interesting. I do like some of the puzzles they made you have to do, like, you know, trying to figure out who to get to grab to go to do what, you know? Um, I guess it's not really puzzles, it's just, like, go back and forth between Samino and, and Jacques in a couple different areas where you had to figure out if you had the right items and whatever. It wasn't really, like, puzzling, I guess. It was just so much... As much as just explore the end of the room, get the right item, and get it, send it back to the other guy. It wasn't so much puzzle solving, I suppose. Though there was puzzle solving mixed in there, which was decent enough. Nothing too 
cryptic. The hardest puzzles were the little pipe puzzles to open up the chests, but those aren't that bad. Those are just a matter of whether or not you like those and have the patience to figure out the right combination to open in all those chests. And I'm pretty sure I opened all those. I didn't skip any, so unless I missed some along the way, which could have happened, I'll never know. <sighs> anyway, all to say right now, I don't have any plans to play any more Onimusha unless I somehow come upon the game. Wink, wink, ethereal. Just saying. Um, that pretty much goes for any game, really, at this point in time. If I don't have the game, I have no plan to play it unless it's part of a series that I'm already working on. That is pretty much my current MO for any game or any series that people want me to play. If I don't have the game, I'm probably not in a hurry to come back to it unless somebody gets me the next game in it. Onimusha is a good example. Because I already had the first three games. I've had them for a long time. I'm glad I could finally get through them all for you guys. Uh, it's just been a series of Let's Plays I've always been kind of wanting to get to, but haven't had a lot of ask for it. I know I've had a few people who are big proponents of it, but not necessarily a lot of people. Um, but I'm glad I can get through the main series. Um, at least, like, the main three. The three that are numbered. Let's just call it that. I know there's another one. It's technically the fourth one. I guess it, I'm guess i guessing the story continues where this left off. I don't know. I, I, that's all I could guess. Um, yeah. That's Onimusha, at least for now. Hopefully you enjoy it. And yes, yes, Predhead, I have played Hollow Knight. Very good playthrough. But one of my favorite, like, indie games I've ever played at this point. It's fucking very good. Very good Metroid-esque game. Um, highly recommend you go check out my playthrough. It's on YouTube. And uh, we may come back to it someday to play the DLC, which I don't know when that'll happen, but I did love the game. So it's definitely one of the kind of games I would like to come back to at some point, just because I loved it. It's good times. Um, I could say I like that more than this game. <laughs> Like I said, I don't give these games... I'm, I'm not a rating guy, but I definitely put these games, these Onimusha games, like a notch below all the other action games i played in terms of quality and how good they are. They're definitely like cheesy B-movie fucking games in a way. Like, the first one's like pretty serious, right? And that one's fine, but it's hella short, so you kind of... It's kinda, almost kind of forgettable. But like, these just... They're okay. Like, these aren't amazing. Capcom's other main series overshadow this for good reason. They really do. Like, the Resident Evil games are obviously where they put most of their love and care. Then, then you know, Devil May Cry is a notch below that. And then you got this shit down on at least third tier, if not lower than that even. And I'm just talking about, like, this the PlayStation main, main series. I'm not talking about, like, Mega Man and shit like that. And Street Fighter, which are, like, literal top tier popularity. But yeah, good times, good times. You don't like how linear these games are? I mean, it's not any different than Devil May Cry with its linearity. Oh yeah, and Monster Hunter. T you know what I meant, Tony. The other Capcom stuff. Phoenix Wright. I'm not even ca I'm not even talking about those ones. I'm talking about action series like these. That's all I'm talking about. Whether it be horror-based or whatever. I'm not talking about those kind of games, even though... You know what I mean. I don't consider Monster Hunter in the same vein as any of these ones I just listed. Like, when they're, like, kind of story-driven action games, Monster Hunter is its own thing. <laughs> Point is, there's a reason why this is a forgotten series of games overall. It has its cult fans, but it's very much... It, it deserves its place at the bottom of the list. Of, of like, longer-running Capcom series that didn't continue on into the new generation, really. Past PS2, really. I don't think they've really tried to make a new one, right? I know they remade the first one. But yeah. Yeah, and like, at least Devil May Cry, you could jump. Capcom! They made this game. You heard it first. Bottom of the list. Shit tier. At least for Capcom. Standards Dragon. Not necessarily for other action games. Anyway, one final thing to tease us for the next game, I'm assuming. Great Nobunaga is dead. Now it is time for the ocean. 
conquer the world. <laughs> Was that guy in a previous game? He looks familiar. Yeah, he's like the small guy from the first game, right? I like I, I recognize his face. I'm like, we definitely seen this guy before. I forgot the names of everybody. Especially since it was like two years ago since I played the first one. Interesting. Well then. Alright, here's our details. Playtime for each character. Almost equivalents. I played as Shamano for 10 minutes more than Jacques, and that is a false statement, because I definitely played as Jacques more, just didn't save the time. Remember how I had to redo that one challenge three times? Definitely played as Jacques more. Uh, he got more souls, obviously, too, because I got to grind it out there at the end. Killed way more enemies, obviously, because of it. Got way more criticals in that w just that one section. And uh, apparently Dark Realm obtained item points. They're, they're equal, because I didn't do any of their shit on the other... The third one. So there you go. Alright. I got cranked. C rank. Did I unlock anything? Mini game has been added to the special features. New game mode has been added to special features. New costume has been added to special features. Ooh. Thunder seal lifted. So these are for the freaking weapon that I did the challenges for. So I unlocked the Ryzon sword. The Enryu sword. And the Shipu sword. Which are all old swords from the old game, I think. At least I recognize that name. Well, it's not a sword, it's the double-bladed staff thing. And I guess we'll make a clear game save, because woo. <laughs> yeah, if you've watched me play any action game, if anything, C-Rank is good for me. Especially with, you know, the lack of focus on anything really. I guess that's just a system save. It didn't even actually make a set a, a, a slot save. All right, well, that's Onimusha 3, y'all. Hopefully you enjoyed. Uh like I already mentioned, we'll maybe we'll do Onimusha 4 one day if I somehow come across a copy. Wink wink. And if that doesn't happen, well, you'll see me on plenty of other video games, that's for sure. Uh Hopefully you enjoyed. Now on to the next game that got voted. So or do you guys really want to see what's in the special features? I guess I could before I call it. Um, we got a Shadow of Rome preview. Oni target practice. That doesn't... I'm good on that. Adventures of Heihachi. Is it a mini game? Yeah, I'll pass. Genma puzzle space. Solve puzzle to advance to the Dark Realm. No thanks. Difficulty. There was... Oh, I must have unlocked hard difficulty for beating the game. Okay, there you go. Jacques attire. Ooh, we got special. Special. We only want new attire for the French chick. We don't care about Jacques. Anyway, there you go. I mean, that's pretty much typical of a of a Capcom action game. You unlock some random little mini game modes and difficulty harder and alternate outfits for your characters. You know. Nothing too crazy uh, interesting there. But, yeah. Um, again, we're done here. I'll see you guys on something else. Peace the hell out.